In this video, I want to share Goran's story with you. When Goran first came to see me, his teeth were severely decayed and worn down due to grinding. He just didn't have enough good teeth to eat with anymore. He's been thinking about replacing them with implants for years. And finally, he's made the decision. On the initial assessment of his three-dimensional scans, I found a cyst in his upper jaw caused by a long-standing tooth infection. The cyst had to be removed first and allowed to heal before implants could be placed. After a further evaluation, Goran opted for six implants in the upper jaw and four implants in the lower jaw. Bone is generally more porous in the upper jaw, so six implants allow for better long-term prognosis. A minimum of four implants is adequate, However, six implants are even more reliable and predictable. In an ideal world, he would have also elected to do six implants in the lower jaw. But to find a reasonable compromise between perfection and finances, he opted for four implants in the lower jaw. After several preparatory appointments, Goran's teeth were removed under general anaesthetic and the implants were placed. The surgery lasted about five hours and was immediately followed by the making of his new teeth while he was still asleep. Goran returned the following day to have his new teeth fitted. The important thing to note is that although most patients who have all on four or any other immediate teeth replacement treatment and have fixed bridges inserted the following day, they have to be very careful eating in the first five months. The diet is pretty much restricted to very soft foods, mashed potato, blended soups, and very soft pasta. The reason for this is even though implants are screwed into the jawbone, they actually take three to five months to integrate and fuse with the jaw. So any pressure that's applied to them in this window of time could cause implants to fail. So I tell all my patients that in the first five months, you'll be proudly showing off your pearly whites, but eating just has to be put on hold. Luckily, not forever. There is a light at the end of the tunnel. After implants become integrated and we fit the final bridge, you can pretty much enjoy all your foods again, like you did back in the good old days. You still have to be a little careful with the very hard crusts and biscuits, and implants have to be cleaned very well at home, as well as maintained by a dentist. But otherwise, they're the next best thing after your natural teeth. To protect Goran's new teeth from wear and fractures due to grinding, Goran was instructed to wear a protective occlusal splint at night. Every time I watch my patients' response to their new teeth, I'm endlessly inspired. They are spectacular. Brand new teeth, incredible, yeah. It's crazy. Yeah, mm. and you can eat with them now too. Yeah, right. Do you feel it's worth it in the end? Do you feel it's worth it? Or it's I, no, no, I do feel it's worth it, of course. It's yeah. worth the confidence. Yeah. I do, yes, absolutely. Amazing. I recommend it. Yeah? If you can afford it, I can recommend it 100%. Yeah. Fantastic. Well, I'm glad, I'm glad to hear. Yeah. Why, um, what prompted the decision in the first place? Um, you obviously had problems for some time with your Problem tape. eating. Um, Confidence, pretty smile, just all those little, you know, little things that you miss. Yeah. Well, I've, I've been on that for years, so. Yeah, you got it's used changed, to it. Yeah. It's changed, yeah. Got used to it, yeah, correct. So this is like a big thing, like being a life thing, I guess. Yeah, yeah. big change yeah, in life. Yeah, it is. Something to get it used is. to, but correct. they look amazing. They look Thank absolutely you. spectacular. I bet they would. Enjoy, <laughs> enjoy. Thank you. We enjoy informing and educating, so if you have found this video valuable, please like it, comment 
and subscribe to our channel.